Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. Alléluia, oh, Alléluia. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we shall serve. What a mighty God we serve. Alléluia. What a mighty God we serve. 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 You are the mighty God, the great I am. Hallelujah, hallelujah. You are the mighty God. You are the great I am. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Honor to the one who can eat ni mo fi yok pe mi fun Olorun to da won o ke igbani eyin ni mo fi ope mi fun tani o tani ngo tun gbega o bi ko se baba loke tani ngo tun fi gbogbo ope mi fun olorun to da won o ke igbani Eyin ni mo fi ope mi fun Olorun Lorun to da awon oke igbani Eyin ni mo fi ope mi fun tani o Tani ngo tun gbega o bi ko se baba loke Tani ngo tun fi gbogbo ope mi fun Olorun to da awon oke igbani eyin ni mo fi ope emi fun Thank you Jesus the lover of my soul Alpha Omega you are worthy to be praised in all generations there is no one like you Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. You are worthy to be praised, amen. You are worthy to be praised, amen, almighty God. You are worthy to be praised. Ah, Jehovah Nisi, you are worthy to be praised, amen. You are worthy to be glorified. You are worthy to be glorified, Jehovah Nisi. You are worthy to be glorified, King of Kings. You are worthy to be glorified. Ah, you are worthy to be glorified. You are worthy to be glorified. Daddy, you are worthy to be glorified. You are worthy to be glorified. You are the Lord that is your name. You will never share your glory with anyone. You will never share your glory with anybody. Almighty God, that is your name. Ancient of this, we bless you. 
for this last day in the month of January, we say glory be to your holy name. Daddy, you have seen us through this month again. How can we thank you enough? You are good. You are kind. You are loving. You are dependable. You are the El Shaddai, Lord. We say glory be to your holy name in the name of Jesus. As we go into prayers, Holy Spirit, have your way. Glorify your name in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Brethren, this is the last day of the month of January. We are alive only because God has kept us. A lot happened even in the past 31 days. Unless we don't want to glorify God. He had provided for you and I. He had kept us in good health. He has been with us. Let us worship him today. Hallelujah. We are going to be praying more of Thanksgiving because this is the last day of the month. We are going to look at the book of Psalm, chapter 103. The Bible says, Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. We all know that song. Let us just sing that song to bless the name of the Lord today. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. He has done great things. He has done great things. Hallelujah. He has done great things. He has done great things. Bless his holy name. Brethren. Let us bless the Lord. Let us thank him. Let us glorify him. Let us honor him. Let us adore him. He is the one that has kept you from the beginning of the month, even up till now. Today is the last day of this month. Let us just praise God. Let us praise him. Let us praise him. Let us praise him. The Lord dwells in the praises of his people. Today, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord Almighty. Honor him, glorify his holy name in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord, brethren. Praise the Lord. Let your spirit, let your soul praise the name of the Lord. He is the King of kings. He is the Lord of lords. He is the mighty man in battle. He is the unchangeable changer. He is the one that remained the same forever. The creator of heavens and the earth. The conqueror, the mighty one, the victorious one. The Lord that came. He lived and died for you and I. Open your mouth and worship him. Worship him, worship him, worship him, worship him today. Just to worship him for who he is. Worship him for who he is to you. Because God is good to you. He's a good God. He's kind. He's faithful. He's merciful. He's the I am that I am. He's the, the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. He is the one hmm, that make it way where there seems to be no way. The over El Shaddai, the over Roy, the over Rafa, the over Sikeno, the over Ropeka. Open your mouth to worship him today. Today we are just going to praise him. We are just going to worship him. Why do we do this? Because he has been so good to us from the beginning of this year up till now. 30 days gone. In 30 days, ask how many people have gone. Ask how many people are dead already. He, he, they, they, they are saying even in the United States that about 2,000 people daily die from COVID. You are alive. You contacted COVID sometime and you are still alive. Worship the name of the Lord. Worship him. Call him his names. Call him the king of kings. Call him the, 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 the burden bearer. Call him the healer. 
Call him the one that keeps you in good health. He says, I am the Lord that he led thee. I am the Lord, your healer. I sent my word and I heal your disease. I am the Lord, your healer. Sing it back to him. Thank him for healing you. Thank him for being there for you. Thank you for keeping your children. Thank him for keeping your home. Thank him for keeping your life. Thank him for keeping your job. Open your mouth and worship him this morning because we are going to receive more reasons to give him glory. The Bible says in verse 3, Psalm 103, it says, He forgives all your iniquities and heal all your diseases. Uh -uh. Open your mouth and thank him for healing all your diseases. Like I sang the song, say to him, you are the Lord that he let me. Say to him, you are the Lord, my healer. You, 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 you sent your word. You heal all my diseases. Father, thank you for healing me. Thank you for forgiving me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, yes, I thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, Baba, you are good. You are kind. You are loving. You are dependable. Who is like unto thee? You are glorious in holiness, Daddy. You are fearful in praises. Father, we praise you. Father, we praise you. You are good, Daddy. You are the almighty God. Hallelujah to your holy name. In Jesus' name we pray. We are going to look at verse 4 because God has done so much for us. Like I said, we just want to thank him today. We just want to praise him today. Today is not the day of give me, give me, give me. It's the day to say thank you for the, 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 the past um, 30 days this year. To say thank you for your children, for your wife, for your husband, for all those that matter to you. Open your mouth and begin to say thank you. The Bible says, and it protects us from death. Hmm. Did the Lord protect you from death this month? One way or the other. Open your mouth and begin to say thank you. His kindness and love are a crown on our heads. Let us thank him for, for keeping us alive. For the breath of life he gives us every single day. Uh, did you sleep this year at all? Have you slept this month? If you did, who woke you up? Do you think it is the alarm? <laughs> ah, go and ask those people that had attack killed. That the enemy mur uh, murdered overnight. And begin to say thank you for the life he has given you. Thank him for giving you life. Thank him for making you alive right now. Thank him for his love for you. Because it is those that he love that he's keeping. Because he loves you. Because he allows his love to be crowned on, uh, on our heads. Let us worship him. Let us worship him. Let us worship him. Let us worship our God and our King. Yes. I, uh, in King James Version says, He redeems your life from destruction. Your, if you think you do not have any enemy, don't look at the enemy, human being as enemy. The devil does not want you to be alive right now. But the Lord has kept you. He did not allow the destruction of the enemy to hit you. Open your mouth and begin to say, Father, I thank you. Father, I give you glory. I thank you. I thank you for life, Lord. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Jesus. I glorify your name for what you are doing. Father, I say be glorified, Daddy. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Then we are going to look at verse 5. It says, it fills my life with good things. It fills my life with good things. As the Lord fills your life with good things. Go ahead and begin to mention those good things he has done for you. Mention the good things, the provisions you receive, the joy of the Lord that has been your strength, what the Lord has been doing in the lives of your children, what the Lord has been doing in the life of your, or your spouse. Open your mouth and say, Father, thank you. Thank you for satisfying my mouth with good things. Thank you for filling my mouth with good things. I have testimonies upon testimonies. If you sit down and listen to me, you will ask me, are you the only one? 
what God is doing in my life. So I am saying thank you, Jesus. I don't know if God is faithful to you, if God has sent destiny helper to you, if God has sent help to you one way or the other. This month, open your mouth and begin to say, Father, we thank you. Lord, we glorify your name. We say, be thou exalted. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Redeemer. Thank you, King of Kings. You are good. You are kind. You are loving. You are my defense. You are the one that did not allow the enemy to prevail over me. You are the one that is satisfying my mouth with good things. Hallelujah to the name of the Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. And it goes ahead and says, so that thy youth is renewed like the eagles. <laughs> Your youth, is it being renewed like that of eagle? Do you say young? Do you stay young? like the eagle. Eagle is always young. And the Lord says to his children, he says, even as your age is, so will your, will your strength be. It increases our strength as we grow. It makes us to look beautiful, radiant, even at our ages. Let us say, Father, thank you. Thank you for renewing my youth like that of eagle. You do not allow me to fall. You do not allow me to be at this age walking on a wheelchair. It is not because we know how to do anything. It is God that has been faithful. Let us glorify his name. Let us honor him. Let us adore him. Hallelujah to the name of the Lord. In the name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen. The Bible says in verse 6, The Lord judges in favor of the oppressed and gives them their rights. As the Lord giving you your rights this month, as the Lord ruled in favor of you, <laughs> brethren, let us go ahead and thank the Lord. Let us honor him. Let us adore him. I just want to give a testimony. Yesterday I was down thinking about this and that and that and that. Brethren, and this morning I was just talking to the Holy Spirit as he talked to me. And he went ahead and told me, remove your focus from the, these earthly things. Look unto heaven. Look unto heaven. It is only God that can judge that uh, every case. It is him that can that can give you peace even when there is war all around you. Can you just thank him for that peace? Can you thank him? Because he executes judgments with, with, to the righteous. He did not allow you to be oppressed by the enemy. Even if you are being oppressed now because he will make it right. Bless his name. Bless his name, bless his name, bless his name. Bless the name of the Lord, brethren. That is what we are going to do today. We will just keep thanking him. He has been good to us. He has been faithful. He has been merciful. He says he will, uh, he, 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 he will be merciful on those who will be merciful. The, the verse 8 of that same Psalm 103 that we are reading says the Lord is merciful and gracious. He is slow to anger. He is merciful. He is gracious. It is not by his grace that we are alive right now. Is it not by his grace that, that, that we are not dead? Is it not by his grace that we are breathing? Open your mouth and begin to say, Father, thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for having mercy on me. Because if it is not because of mercy, you would have thrown me into hell a long time ago. Father, thank you. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your grace. You are so merciful. You have plenty of mercy. Father, I bless your name. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. The Bible says, I'm jumping to verse 11 because I'm looking at the time. I don't want to stay too long. But you can continue to pray and, and praise God. Praise God all day today. Because today is the last day of the month of January. So that you enter into the next month, that is February, in joy. Joy from inside you in the name of Jesus. So we are going to go to verse 11. It says, even as the heaven... As high as the sky is above the earth, so great is his love for those who honor him. Do you honor the Lord? His love is so great. Just thank him for his love. Because, <laughs> hey, if God does not love you, oh, I wonder what will be what this heart would have become. Just thank Jesus and say, Father, thank you for your love for me. Thank you for loving me so dearly. Thank you for loving me this much. Thank you because of your love. 
because the Bible makes us to know that God is love. And his love is so big, you cannot, there is no way we can fathom it. That we say, Father, thank you for your love for me. Thank you for your love for my household. Thank you for your love for my children. Thank you for your love, O Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. We are going to look at verse 13. The Bible says, like a father pitied the son, so does he, uh, does he pity me. We are going to look at another version. It says, as a father is kind to his children, so the Lord is kind to those who honor him. Do you honor the Lord? The Lord is kind to you. Thank him for his kindness. Thank him for his goodness. Thank him for his mercy. Thank you for his pity. Thank you because you are you 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 are being kept under uh, 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 under his wings. Thank you. Thank him because you are in his in the hollow of your hands. He cover you under his wings. He did not allow the enemy to reach you. He did not allow the hands of the evil uh, the devil to reach you. Open your mouth and say, Father, we thank you. Thank you. Well, let us thank him for going out. Let us thank him for coming in. Let us thank him for sleeping. Let us thank him for waking up. Let us thank him for the past 30 days. Let us thank him for the time that we slept. Because it is not what we know to do. Hmm. It is not what we know to do, brethren. A friend of mine was just driving on his own. Another car hit him. Thank God everything was okay. It could have been worse. So let us thank him. Let us thank God for life. Let us thank God places that you go some people go there and die some people will be traveling to fro to fro and to one state from another state to another state nothing will happen to them because the lord will he will have mercy on whom he will have mercy and some people just once they will travel something will go wrong it is not what you know to do. It is only God that is merciful on you. Just open your mouth and just worship him for that traveling, for moving from one side to the other that you have done this week, for jumping on the bike, even this month, and coming down safely. <laughs> Glory be to God. He's so good. He's faithful. He's so faithful. Open your mouth and worship the Lord. Worship him, glorify him, adore him. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. Amen. I want you to choose a song from your mind. It could be any dialect. Just sing to him. Just say thank you, to say thank you, to say thank you, to say thank you, to say thank you. Thank you for January that is ending. And thank him ahead. For the month of February, we are coming into tomorrow. And say, Father, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Redeemer. Thank you, ancient of this. Thank you, lion of the tribe of Judah. Thank you, I am that I am. You are good. You are kind. You are loving. You are dependable. Who can compare with you? You are the ancient of this. You are the lion of the tribe of Judah. You are the one that has seen us even up till today. Father, we do not take it for granted. We say be thou exalted in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, we have worshipped. Amen. And so, because we have worshipped the Lord, it is time for you to ask one thing of the Lord. One thing that you know it is only God that can do, that you want to be able to testify. Can you go ahead? You have one minute to do that. Rebo Sondo Ko Rebo Sondo, you ask the Lord for one thing. You have worshipped him you have thanked him now ask for one only one prayer point today is that you should ask for your desire and ask the lord to make it come to pass the lord almighty will answer your prayer he will answer it as a matter of priority you that are sick, you will be healed in the name of Jesus. 
You that are in one bondage or the other, you are released today. You are released in the name of Jesus. You are released in the name of Jesus. You are released in the name of Jesus. Yes, you that you are, you are complaining about financial, financial problem. The Lord is about to send you help. The Lord is about to send help to you. Begin to thank him for that ahead. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Ah, that home that is experiencing problem. Time for turn around this year. You are like them that dream when the Lord turn again the captivity. It is so in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. And so, Heavenly Father, we thank you. We give you glory for you've had us today. Accept our thanks in Jesus' name. We go forth into this week in your power. And we know you have done it. And we know you, you we will see again next week as you leave. And we know our prayer request will be answered by fire. And we know that you have received that thanksgiving. In Jesus' most precious name, we have prayed. Amen. My name is Pastor Lara Obiwumi. I want to encourage you, brethren, if you are watching this prayer, you are not born again, please give your life to Jesus. You get the ultimate results when you have Jesus on your boat. Give your life to Jesus. As you do so, God bless you. Amen. Like I said, my name is Pastor Lara Obiwumi. Subscribe to my YouTube page. Comment. Put testimonies there. And the Lord will bless you as you do so. I love you. Jesus loves you better. I'll see you next week if Christ tarries. Love you.